So I ran into a problem this afternoon when I started my truck after going to the restaurant. The instrumentation was dead. I noticed it at about five minutes after I was driving. I looked down and there's no gauges. The indicator over here is working and the truck runs fine and everything seems to work except the dash. Now I haven't shut it off and restarted it. I wanted to get home just in case it was a problem. Now normally you get this flash screen. So let's turn the key off, open the door, let's try and restart it. Well, that's not good. No splash screen. Now does it move? Yeah. Hmm. That's interesting. Got 96% battery remaining. I just drove it from town. Well, throw the scanner on it and see if there's any codes. Well, I just got in the truck. After going to grab the scanner, and I see the dash is lit up. Well, I'm going to use the scanner to record. I just updated this scan tool yesterday. Let's see if it supports this EV. It should, it's a 22. Forty five thousand four hundred ninety six kilometers. Code scan. Pre scan. Engine is not running. Well, there is no engine. It's in the ready mode. Second row center seat belt sensor. I've been getting a message about the seat belt in the back occasionally, but that's minor. Not a current DTC. So far 27 computers, 31, 34 computers, 38 computers. Turn the radio down. But now the instrumentation is working. Hmm. 51 controllers. That's it, 51 computers. Snap-on should prioritize them by modules with codes. That's it, just a seatbelt. Left front camera, no signal. Right front camera, no signal. Camera module, no signal. Secondary OBD2 proximity detection circuit. Signal stuck high. Lost communication with hybrid EV powertrain control module. Lost communication with battery charger control module. Wow, that's crazy the amount of computers in this thing. But I don't see any codes related to the instrumentation. Yet it's working again. Okay, well, I've got a report. Let's go back. Switch the ignition off. Continue. Let's 
Let's go and read clear all codes read by code scan. Engine off. There is no engine. The instrumentation was working fine and all I did was walk to the garage and update my scan scanner. I'm going to check to see if there's any software updates recently done. Fifty one controllers. That's just nuts. Snap on, we need a topology map. So what would they call that? Instrument cluster? Hmm. Uh, general software updates. Let's see if there was any recent updates. What's new? Software revision. Software update. Completed vehicle communication and technical adjustment improves the way your vehicle receives and transmits software, resulting in a more dependable update experience. Doesn't say when this was done. Update details. Well, what was the details? Don't recall seeing that. I wonder if uh, the Ford Pass app tells me if there was an update just recently accomplished. Well, we're gonna disregard this problem for now. There's not much we can do about it because the problem's not present now. Cluster is working fine. Unless it was in some kind of software update. Oh well. So I've gone into the instrument cluster itself and let's do a key on engine off self test. Press continue. No codes present. Well, again, we're going to just take note of this occurrence and see what happens in the future. Not much else we can do.